Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and today's video is a very 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 highly awaited video like some of you have been desperately waiting for me to film this video and I'm really sorry that it took so long but today I'm gonna talk about a very very favorite cult product and it is the pixie glow tonic now ever since a pixie beauty launched on nika i've been super duper excited to get my hands on this because i was waiting to buy this even before that and pixie beauty was sold at some, like it's been in sephora india um, and it's been sold via sephora india for a very long time and i was planning on picking it up but then the lockdown happened and like malls shut down so obviously i couldn't get my hands on it and i haven't shopped from sephora like online ever i i always go to like a sephora store if i want to pick something up which is why i was not able to get like get my hands on it like through any means uh, and then when Nike launched it, I was so, so, so happy about it. And those of you who follow me on Instagram would totally, completely know how excited I was. And uh, yeah, some of you have been, you know, patiently waiting for this video to come out. So I thank you from the bottom of my heart for all of that patience. And now I'm going to tell you if, um, you know, this product is worth it or not. Do I feel like you should... Go ahead and spend the money on this or not if it's worth the hype or not etc etc so here it is uh, before we proceed with this video i do want to ask you guys that if you're new to my channel please 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 go ahead and subscribe and click the red button down there and also hit in the bell which is next to the subscribe button because if you don't do that you won't actually get a notification whenever i post a new video which is three times a week and you might miss a lot of the content that i have coming for you so yeah definitely make sure do that as well but now with that out there let's dive right in and let's talk about this this amazing product which has uh, you know taken the world by a storm because it's so 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 extremely popular and uh, yeah I want to share with you what I think about it now first of all this is something uh, it's a chemical exfoliation product which honestly I did not know for the longest time like I discovered that this has uh, glycolic acid I would say relatively recently earlier I used to think that it's a toner that is going to make your skin glow which it does do because it gets rid of all of the dead skin cells that is sitting on your skin it has 5% glycolic acid which is I would say relatively, um, it it belongs to the category of products which is like relatively more gentle on the skin. But there are a lot of people who have said that even though it is um, supposed to be a more gentle product, but it's not suitable for their skin. So if you have sensitive skin, I'm not really sure if it will work for you or it will not work for you. So you have to take my opinion like with a grain of salt and it's very relative obviously because we all have different skin. I am someone who has slightly more tougher skin and because i've been using chemical exfoliation products for you know a while now i feel like most things tend to like not give me any sort of like adverse reactions or anything and stuff mostly tends to work for me like most of the products that i've discovered i haven't discovered anything that um, you know does not work for me like absolutely does not work for me or has given me some sort of a reaction so do keep that in mind if you have sensitive skin i would choose to not comment on that particular aspect but yeah it does have five percent glycolic acid i have a couple of videos which i've already done uh, in the month of july which i'm going to leave a link in the description box if you want to know how to incorporate this in your routine i would suggest that you go and check out those videos rather than this one but what this product basically does is, is that it helps to get rid of all of the dead skin that is sitting on your skin that's what glycolic acid and AHAs is supposed to specifically do it works on the surface level whereas BHAs on the other hand go deep into your pores so if you have oily skin if you have acne prone skin or you tend to have closed pores or closed comedones or uh, closed pores no clogged pores or closed comedones uh, for that what you should be using is a BHA so do keep in mind that at least for me personally, like if you have a skin type like I do, which is normal combination to oily, acne prone skin as well, and I tend to have clogged pores every once in a while. So if I don't take good care of my pores, then they can tend to be clogged. So if you have a skin type like that, even this, even though this product works and it will do a good job, but it won't do a very good job at unclogging your pores. So that you're gonna need a BHA. 
so keep in mind that this product on its own is not going to give you like all of the amazing results in terms of your skin that you want to so do do keep in that uh, to keep that in mind if you have acne prone skin and oily skin or combination skin you're gonna need something that has AHAs and BHAs or you're gonna have to go for something like go for one product that has AHAs and then go for another product that has BHAs because you will have to incorporate both of them in your routine Coming back to this product, but I will say that it is worth the hype. At least that's what I personally feel because I do see really good results with it. It is also a gentler product because it is a toner and because it has a lower concentration of like AHAs. And uh, yeah, that is it. I mean, that's all I can tell you. I love using it. It also has a... Um, it has a fragrance but it's not like an intense fragrance it's not something you're gonna feel like oh my god this is like extremely fragrant it's very mild it's very gentle and it makes like it makes the experience of using the product even better and another reason why i feel like this is worth the hype is because this product has been in the market for years and back when this was first launched there weren't a lot of other products which had AHAs and BHAs in them like AHAs and BHAs are relatively newer to the market and all the products that have been coming out have been coming out in the past one year maybe even two years but this product has been in the market for like years and years and years like maybe even over a decade I'm not sure in which year this was launched they do say that it's uh, like Pixie Skin Treats since 1999. So I don't know if the product is 21 years old or if the brand is 21 years old. So keep that in mind. If, I, if I'm able to find additional information, I'm going to leave that also in the description box. But I'm pretty sure that when this was launched, there weren't a lot of other products in the market which did a good job like this did. So I feel like for that reason, it's worth the hype. And I feel like another reason why I would say it's worth the hype is because even though it is relatively expensive but i feel like when you look at the value it's a very good value like this is just a 100 ml bottle and it looks super small but this product is going to easily last you for like four to five months it's going to last a very long time like the amount of product that you get so when you compare the value and when you see for how long it's going to last um i think that is also something that you need to consider and that also makes it worth it I do have to say though that there are a lot of other like like I said uh, in the past year we've been seeing a lot of newer AHAs and BHAs and like other chemical exfoliators come out in the market and there are definitely uh, more options that you can find which are probably a little bit cheaper than this so um, because I haven't tried any of them out personally I can't tell you if you can dupe them or if you can find alternatives or not. Uh, I'm still on the hunt, I'm still looking for options and I'm always open to trying out other options and other products out there. So if you think that there is anything similar to this that you want me to try out, then leave it in the comment section. I have my own list as well. I'm looking at trying out other alternatives as well. So um, yeah, I'm not saying that you have to go out and spend 1200 on this product. You can, um, you know, look for other alternatives as well, something that would probably be relatively cheaper. So um, yeah, that is that. If you ask me, should you go ahead and spend 1200 on this? I will say yes, because I feel like it's worth it. I don't regret spending my money on this, but you can, again, find options as well. So yeah, that is my verdict on this product. I really hope that you know, I could answer your doubts and I could share my thoughts with you. Again, like I mentioned, I would have links for previous videos in which I've spoken about this product as well and which I've spoken about more in detail. So you can go and check those out. If you want to know how to incorporate this in your regime, if you want to see how I have incorporated this in my regime, again, check the, the links in the description box. And if you have any questions, anything that I was not able to answer, then you can leave that uh, like as a comment in the comment section of this video and I will get back to you as soon as I can but yeah thank you so 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 much for watching this video I really hope I could answer your questions but with that we're gonna end this video now thank you so 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 much for watching until next time bye bye bye